Ryder, seventh place in the Tour de France. How does that feel? Ah, it's unreal. I've been saying it for uh, uh, you know, a few days now, and uh, it's just unbelievable. Uh, great day today. You know, what can I say? I'm going to enjoy tonight and just really uh, enjoy the rest of the season and couldn't be more happy. The team was awesome, you know. Again, I think we showed ourselves really good from the beginning and uh, what more can you ask for? I just, uh, uh, you know, well, <laughs> it's hard to describe. A little bit of drama yesterday. You crossed the line in that time trial and because of the wind, it looked like you felt maybe you'd blown your chances for a top 10. Well, uh, I was just, I just, uh, it just felt so horrible out there, you know, you just can't imagine that uh, guys are going slower than you, <laughs> so uh, it was, yeah, you know, I, I didn't have radio communication early on, so I was a bit out there on my own and just, uh, you know, I just had to dig deep and give it all I had and, you know, it's just that uncertainty, you know, you get a little bit worried, it's a long time out there, but. You know, I guess uh, I rode well and it worked out really well. I'll ask you one last question. I asked you before, did you have to dig deep to uh, to do well in this Tour de France? You said you didn't. Uh, is, is that still the case or were you, were you going down deep to, to make seventh in Paris? Uh, well, I definitely went deep in this race. This is the Tour de France. But I think I showed that I was getting better as the race went on. And I think I had my best rides uh, minus stage three, uh, you know, in the second and third week. So. What, what more can you ask for? You know, I'm just looking forward to seeing where I can take it. Good luck. All right, thanks. Thanks, Mariah.